Oh, Nintendo. Hello, welcome to Game Ready Review. My name is Jamar Lejean, and today we're talking about this weird thing that Nintendo's doing. As you know, I may or may not be a fan of Splatoon, and I think it looks kind of weird, but my friend Tyler speaks very highly of it. He says it's a fun. Now, the new one's coming out for Nintendo Switch, and good. Is it enough to keep the excitement for the Switch going? Mm, I don't know. We'll see how the cells go. It looks interesting. But in Japan specifically, they're doing something extremely interesting. Nint Nintendo... So, so I'm so confused. Nintendo is going to, like, get, get you a box, right? This box. Uh, and it, it's the pre-order box with the Nintendo Switch and Splatoon. Except they won't have those things. It's just an empty box. It has some Splatoon art on it. And it's an empty box. And in the equivalent of American dollars, it's $5. You can buy an empty Splatoon, like, big with the switch on it and splatoon on it and it's an empty box nintendo said it's for people who don't already own yeah who already own a nintendo switch and i guess want to put it in a box so so nintendo it, like maybe they made too many boxes for the splatoon bundle and they're like hey let's just sell them off for five dollars a pop like, I used to use my PS3 box as the box I would carry my PS3 around in and my Xbox as well, actually, Xbox 360. And, yeah, that's fine. Cause, you know, I didn't want to buy a big book sack. I didn't, whatever. I don't care. Um, but, I mean, do they really think people are that big a fan of Splatoon, number one, and that they're going to use, that they want to buy? This is only being sold in Japan on July 21st. Um, and nowhere else, not, not America or anywhere, UK or Australia, nowhere else. I think it'd be funny to just buy it without even owning a Switch or Splatoon. Just have it in the background. People are like, wow, you have a Switch? No. Oh, but you got the bundle box. No, I don't. I just thought the box was cool and I bought it. I'm actually keeping my Vita in there and all my Vita games because that's ironic. I don't get you, Nintendo. If you're watching Game Ready Review, my name is Morgan Lamb. Please hit the like subscribe button. Uh, tell me what you think about this. I'd like to hear that. Um, thank you for... Uh, yeah, uh, just... That was my opinion on how weird Nintendo's being. Weird. Weird.